president in 2023, which they will not be alive. I am saying this thing for all of us to wake up. These governors need to be visited one after the other. They need to be visited one after the other. They need to die. They need to die. Let us pay them back what they are doing to us. Let us pay them back what they are doing to us. It is very, very important. The blood of the innocent that have been shed in Ebony State is too much. And the such governors, and we can never forgive them. We must have this thing in mind. Let nobody come out. I heard of a negotiation. I will come to that in Imo State. Governors like Devil Mine, Hope Uzodima, Yesom Wike, Obiano, these people that brought the military, they are not supposed to be alive. At any point, you got them. Get them down. Get them down. They need to die. Enough to all this nonsense. Because as we keep on, what are they doing? Could they build a good road for you? Could they, is this school? Go to social media and see where people are recording schools, where people, where children are attending. Despite the billions we hear, they are receiving every month. What are they doing with it? Nothing. They couldn't do anything. And now they are supporting the killings. They are silent. When you are silent, when evil is going on, that means you are a part of it. It's very, oh, in people language, that's all baranketi kwerekwe. Obarankiti, Maragini, is agree. You agree with what is going on. They are the one inviting these people. Our blood has been shared day and night, and you are keeping quiet. These politicians need to go down one after the other. If you have the assets, make sure you execute it. Don't fear. That day is your last day. To God be the glory. But make sure you go with these wicked ones. Your children, your brother that are still on earth, will have a good life to live. Let's have this understanding. Nobody lives forever. And the most, the people that are very afraid of death are these criminals that have looted money. They would like to enjoy those money. And in the world now, there is no place for them to enjoy the ill-gotten money, if not in zoological republic. That is why when you, uh, when the issue of a restructure comes out, they will not resource control. They don't want uh, disintegration. Nothing. They just want the zoo to be as it is so that they will be enjoying. The money they send in abroad, when they need it, they will go and withdraw it and come in the zoo and be enjoying it. That is the environment they want. So they are the ones that are really afraid of death, not you. They don't want to die because of that money. So that is why you need to hit them. They say that the fear of death is more painful than the death itself. None of them are sleeping. These governors need to, we need to start with them. If you have access, you are a driver to him, you are a cook to him, you are whatever. And you have the same spirit in me, the same spirit of Biafra, poison him, sabotage him, kill him. It's not a sin. We must have that in mind. Very, very important. Very wicked people. Look at the killings. In a boy state presently now, some of our, your own flesh and blood, my own flesh and blood are being abducted. And if they abduct them, they are not returning. Nobody hears account of them. Courtesy of the Al-Shabaab. Courtesy of the repentant Boko Haram in Nigerian military. Courtesy of the Al-Qaeda that they have been recruited as Nigerian soldiers. Telling them what to do. Courtesy of them, they will kill them. For no reason. For no reason. These are innocent youth. You could not provide any job for them. You didn't do anything, no hospital, nothing. They are struggling to survive. Even some go to farm. After farming, they will send herdsmen to go and destroy their farm. How do you want person to survive? But these wicked politicians are there enjoying their life and you are clapping hands for them. Are we not foolish? Are we not stupid? Let's rise up against them. If you have access to any of them, destroy them. Hope Zodimba must die. Hope must die. That man must die. That man is not supposed to live again. And for all of you, listen, the other day, last week, there was a solidarity match going to the government house to say you're in support of... You see why black people are foolish. When Ohamadike will come on air and be talking about black people, some of you will not be comfortable with that statement. But your own, on, on your own eyes, koro koro, you will see the foolishness of your brothers. You see the foolishness of your brothers being displayed. Look at what is going on in Imo State. And some people call themselves youth. And they are marching in solidarity with the governor that brought the military to kill his own brother. Those people that are marching on the street call themselves youth and whatever. Some of them, their relative is still in FMC. 
in the mortuary. They have not buried them. And you imagine on the street in solidarity of the man whom the caliphate are using to kill you. Gets in him on a sense. Gets in him my hand. Gets in him mad. All of you, both the organizer of that match, you will die. All of you will die. You will be visited. I am telling you. All of you. Because then you go to one chunchi ego. Ego naga his rugi. What about then you give 50,000, 100,000? I always say this thing. When they give you those money, convert it into the foreign currency. And see whether it's not even up to what somebody used to go out for. That is what somebody have used to buy your soul. You are doing a, 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 a protest in solidarity for peace to come. How will peace come? Whereby a, a, the caliphate is there in Imo state. Caliphate is there bringing in Al Shabaab as police and they are killing your people. Did the Hopu Zodimba win election? Did he win election for Imo state? So you want us to be keeping quiet and the Fulani will be deciding for us from time to time, telling us who to rule us. We are no more human being. Very soon now, you stop eating Igbo food. You start eating Hausa food. Look at your governors. All of them wear Danchiki. They don't wear, they are, they are not comfortable in putting the real Igbo tradition. They are not comfortable. All they put is just to, to make sure that the, the, the Fulani is like them. And you are doing a solidarity match or whatever in the, in, 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 for the governor, for him to appoint you one commission or the other. All of you that did that, those people that call themselves the youth, we are seeing your faces. You will pay. I'm telling you, your brother, your, your own brother, their dead bodies are still in the mortuary. They have not been buried. And you are supporting the man who brought the people that killed them. You are supporting him. Solidarity match. You want peace to reign. How can peace reign when where there is injustice? How can peace reign in Imo State when Hope Zodima is still the administrator of the state? How can peace reign? There will never be peace. Forget about it. You want peace to reign so that you start your club drinking and the eating and dancing. And the, that is what you want every night. Whereby Fulani are, are rounding up your villages, coming in gradually. If not, our dear brother, may his soul continue to rest in peace. Mazi Konso, that did a very wonderful job in Imo State. By now, as the Al Shabab is in the city, as a police and the military, they will just round you up from behind. That is what that is their plan. If not, that our brother that make sure that he led out the group of uh, boys under him to make sure that they fight the terrorists in the bush. This is what would have been happening presently now. But all of you are very stupid. You like to drink, eat, relax. Whereby danger is coming. You want peace. If you want peace to reign, first of all, remove the Fulani administrator. Remove him first. That idiot must get away. That idiot must get away. Why is it that before you get a governor, before you become anything, you go and meet Fulani man? Fulani man in Sokoto, Fulani man in Kebi, in Kastena, and whatever. Useless. Those states produce nothing. That is where you go. Then they will approve it before you come and become our own ruler. That's gone. That is why if you are there begging for peace and whatever, you are wasting your time. Maybe on the process, you just die foolishly. The earlier you get, you have your brain fixed well, the better for you. You need to equip yourself. And wherever you see the Al-Shabaab in their hillocks, the al Qaeda in their hillocks in, in, in Nigerian uh, um, uh, uniform, you attack them. You destroy them. Put fear in them. Let them go back. Tell them that you are awoken. Whatever you have, are you in your house and they are coming to abduct you? No, you are not coming back. Have it in mind that you are not coming back. Make sure that you and that particular one that comes in there goes down there. It's better for you. Or go to a bejrikiji. Go to a tinyishinime room again. Let the one outside shoot you and you die. All of you are dead there. You go with something. We must have this thing in mind. Not to come and do solidarity match because then you get 5,000 naira, 10,000 naira. Just like people came out on June 12th. We saw the clips. They said that they gave them more, they promised them more 1,000 naira to come and stand for Buhari. You see how useless we black people are. You criticize yourself first. You criticize yourself every time. 
white people white people are doing us this damn who sold your ancestors to slavery it is the same black they used to sell their own black people the same thing is happening at this time can anything good can our some man can a flanny man think something good for you that is the question you ask yourself these are the people that have been killing you since 1945 can they think anything? Can they plan anything good for you? The answer is no. It will never. It has never worked, and it will not work. The earlier you have sense, the better for you. Politicians need to go down. Saboteurs need to go down. BBC Ibo need to be addressed. Can you address BBC Ibo? Even if you can't get the look at foolish people. BBC Ibo, your headquarters is in Abuja, Lagos. Not in any. Not in even the so-called Owe. You are going to record all manner of nonsense. These are the kind of things we have. Deciding for us where to stay, how to do. Look at this news now. Uh, uh, SND, bo, SND bo in, uh, in, uh, in Ubaosa. They, <laughs> our people are really foolish. Our people are really foolish. You know, I don't need to read the news because the, the contents of the community, I don't need to mention it. But let me explain. A group of um, uh, SND bos in, in Ubaosa in the north, they, they come together and write a communique that they are not in support of the secessionists. They are against whatever, that the government should come and flow. Because two by two. You see why we don't pray for you? All of you in the north, the whole Ezebos, the whole Ezebos in the north, you know, uh, uh, why we don't we are not worried about you is because you people will be time will come forget about what is happening in the east it will now turn they'll start killing you there they will start killing you they have a meet they have their meeting and they communicate and whatever the whole they said they the the 19 northern SND boss <laughs> i just read it and i laugh you know i laugh <laughs> hey what will happen to them the day it will happen nobody nobody should do what nobody should pity them because it's going to happen our people are really foolish they say that they're against the secessionist uh, movement the ipob and they classify us as a bandit and whatever nonsense they wrote in that their communique i don't want to read it in details because uh, uh, there are some certain statements that will be uttered by your own people it's very very irritating it's better that that an enemy says such a use such uh, 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 language than my own person. I'm telling you the truth. But what we are telling you, those of you in the north, those Ezebos, maybe you are listening, or they will take this clip to you, cut it and send to them. We are telling you that your days are numbered. Not we, we are not going to attack you. No. The Fulanis will kill you because they never change. They are still the same people. The, for, for, there, 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 there was a, um, a clip I was just watching on Natural Geography. There was a tiger in a zoo. The, 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 that tiger, they gave him food, and now they threw in another live goat, you know, inside. He has finished the other one, and the other goat is just uh, jumping around with him. The tiger was just waiting, let hunger come back. The moment hunger come back, he now killed that uh, goat. But they have been there for some time. As if he's his friend, as if they are the same man. That is how you are. By the time their blood tested demon will rise upon them. And I will never be so. It's just like a man. There was a guy in Meduguri when uh, what is the name? Uh, was the, the former governor? The former governor of uh, Meduguri, uh, uh, Bruno State. Uh, what's the name of this governor? The the present former governor. You know, he met that guy in his filling station. He said he's not interested in Biafra or whatever. It's not up to some weeks. They went and killed the man. They went and killed the man. That is how all of you in that, I, I read the news, is from Vanguard. All of you is in the boss in Ubaosa 19. And you people will die there. You will not return back alive. Very, very important. Look at how they are destroying your home. And you, even the middle belt, the people who answer the same name, you, uh, eat the same food with them, do everything, even give them their land, fight battle with them. They are still killing them. Right from Adam. Right from Adam. You want to peace in Nigeria in the north because you have two by two or your hotel in Damatura or whatever. They will burn you and burn you inside that hotel. 
We are telling you the truth. You know, in Radio Biafra, we don't hide what. We just tell you how it is. Very, very important. They are abducting our youth in Ebony State. Very, very important. Let me read this news that sent to me. Attention to Umuchuku writers has been drawn to crime against humanity happening in Naval Base or Wedenta. Intel gathered from our intelligence unit has proven that there is a mass execution of innocent unarmed Biafran youths at Naval Base in Owerenta. A lot of Biafran youths are languishing in their dungeon while many have been executed. Early last week, a full bus loaded with passengers was diverted into Naval Base Owerenta. The passengers have been held in communicado till now. And from the time info, the time we gather info, they have all been executed. The usual business going on at the naval base of Renta now is the execution of innocent unarmed Biafran youth and the selling of their organs. This is what is happening presently now at naval base in Owerenta, you know. And there are burning of houses in a burning state. They will abduct somebody. They say it's an IPOB, this, that, and they will burn their house down. This is what the Al-Shabaab and uh, the Al-Qaeda and the uh, uh, Taliban's in Nigerian police and military uniform are doing. We are bringing all this information that have been circulating on social media for you to be aware what is going on and for you to know that we are not going to relent. You have not seen anything. If you are praying for peace to come in our land with this, because we will make everywhere a peace. This is very, very important. Opus Zodimba is spending money, bringing security, money he would have used to do what? To build infrastructures. Let those youth that they are killing to have job, build companies, as Mbappé did during his own time. This idiot, this idiot, to buy security men that they will guide him. Your security is nothing because they are human. The only thing that can save you, unless you the other word and bring spirits that will, bullet will not penetrate them because as they are shooting the people are shooting them they have thought, and they will die and the, the gods will be a witness because we are honest very very important this is radio Biafra service to coming to you from the platform of radio Biafra london under the leadership of one and only onion do mazin one of biafra land and he's the commander of the armies of biafra Right now, our lines will be open for other interaction. You can call in with this number, plus 183-263-73499. I repeat, plus 183-263-73499. Or you can get us, plus 614-818-7777. Plus six one four eight one eight seven zero nine two five. Let's take this call. Caller, you are live on air. You can tell us your name and uh, where you are calling from. Caller, can you hear me? Yeah, Chineke. Uh, good morning from here. I am calling you from Oka, the capital of uh, Omambala State. Uh, my name is uh, Maase Kudumba. Um, for a long time now, uh, I don't have the opportunity to call because even our radio was not working before. But thank God for everything. Yes, uh, time has come. Our people, their eyes are now open. Even the radio, Zoo Radio, our people are now saying their mind without minding whatever that will happen. But this morning, I want to talk to our Arewa brothers. That is Hausa Habe. I want to talk to them. And those people in the so-called Northern, uh, Northern Nigeria. 
and we talk to them in the language they will understand. And we have to get prepared to start interpreting uh, what is happening uh, in the country. Because many of our, brethren, our brothers, they're not on the, the houses, they don't hear English. Like the publication of the 16 men that hold Nigeria hostage. I need to work on that so that we can announce it one after the other. Let's know who is who, because those 16 men, about uh, five is um, uh, uh, maybe from Middle Bed and the South, South, uh, they call it the South, South, or Southwest. Uh, our blood in the Northerners, I want them to understand that the remaining uh, uh, 10 or 11, they are all Fulanis. Uh, they are so-called President Say Baba. It's number one. The wife is there. Mohammed is there. Zara is there. Let me speak to them in our language so that I don't waste our time. Assalamu alaikum. Kuya wana yam hausawa habi. Somebody are going hausa habi. Pulani sun zoda sun chemuku. Hausa pulani. Amayo. Se pulani. Tunde hausawa ni sun kache. Se baba. Se baba. Bama sorna. To. Se kuduba. When they na iya chemuku shi muslimini. Kuduba de when they cook a chair, she arnini. Arna wasuni. Sunka bude muku kasanku. Sunka ni memuku aiki yi. Amasu muslimi ding. Masu de abin de sasui. Se de suna tata kudimu. Kuma suna aswa. Suna rente. Akasan China. Buru ba kenang. Kudin de ke anu su. Zen yi kokeri. Zen so mrubu ta da 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 da. Zen karantamuku. E awo jemu. A kwe wadana che de shi ngige. De roti timi amechi. A chan kuma se la long. Na na platu. Gom na platu. A ma sa wang fa. A kwe gudadi u kuma chan kasan yoruba wa. A ma sha de a dukan su pula nini. Son sa che kudi wan na kasan gabat de ya. Ba kwa kobo. Wan de ya regi. Se kuma re nche su ke suwa. Su chima mu bashi. Kunge ni abinde ni ke son gya muku. Pula ni su nse ni che wa. Nkunzoma masu asiki. Baza su iya. Su na binku. Kamanda ke bin shanu. Delili ke nan. Du kompin wande ke nan kasang. Su rupe ta. Wajen da ke samu kudi na jama. Su rupe shi. Wajen da ke samu aiki yi. Na samarimu wande sunji makaranta. Ya wande basu jama kato tamba. Su rupe duka. Suna so su mede mu, muzama duka mu, muzama shanu su. Sama da haka fa, aski ya ke gabango shi. Kujira mu, chaare wa, ana puruba, na muna sama labia. Ama sojo jisi, suna tura su su anang. Bada mwa, zamu wanke kasamu de jini su. Nisha alawu, asalamu alaikum. Ope Biafra. Ope Biafra, asalamu alaikum. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much for your wonderful contribution, uh, mostly in the language that they will understand as well. <laughs> this one is uh, on, a, on a normal one, not on that type uh, that the Buhari said he will speak to us. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, my dear. This is Radio Biafra as a service to coming to you from the platform of Radio Biafra London. Our lines are open right now. You can call in for your contribution with this number plus one eight three two six three seven three four nine nine. Let's take this call. Caller, you are live on air right now. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. If you can hear me, caller. Yes, I can hear you. I can hear you watching Nikki. You are welcome, brother. Um, that should be uh, a good morning. in Russia, right? E calling from uh, the city of Sochi, the uh, great city of Russia, and the, the Olympic city. Uh, indeed, dear friends, uh, uh, thank God for what is happening now in our land and the, the awakening of our people. 
uh, our brother and dad who's just spoke now uh so much appreciate and so much in, uh like the way he put everything uh in a nutshell uh to the uh, to the hearing of our uh non-speaking non-english speaking uh indigenous that are uh, have been locked 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 down in this zoological public especially there in the middle bed and also in the northern zoo um so thank you Kevin, for making it possible for everybody that is all of them to uh get the message at the end in the language they understand it is quite interesting and also uh glory to elohim who made it possible through our little mountain and can by setting up this great uh, platform to be afraid because i know that since after the uh genocide war of 1967 to 1970 nothing have joined us together nothing we can be able to call our own uh as a people except this uh, platform ready to be afraid and uh, our little man and the kind of yellow he making uh, using to uh set up this platform imagine if we didn't have this platform what would have happened nobody would have hear our voice and they, they will continue their genocide as they did in 1967 and then uh, british will help them to cover it through their ivo bbc uh indeed uh many people uh really now in uh that is the both in middle bed i saw this morning the flag of uh, the, uh, the middle bed and also the uh the one of uh, uh as other regions in the in other in, indigenous people are waking up so that shows that uh, the, the message is sinking the message our people are getting the message because uh the impunity the fulani uh tend to wait uh caliphate plan to unleash on that is on the indigenous people that inhabited the land where they intruded uh, already be after through, through this platform uh, our leader had, had thwarted all their plan and that's why they are uh, they but quite unfortunate they couldn't uh, carry it on god they plan it to uh start happening uh, uh, but uh, uh, through through the wisdom that God gave our leader, He made him He have made them now even start their their plan earlier, two years earlier. That is uh, what they are, what is happening since last year till now. So that's to show all that uh, dear friends, we are the most luckiest pe people in that particular. Uh, uh, zoo because if not that uh, god love us he would have given us somebody like mazin because you can imagine if not him what would have been of our people and the the plan of these people uh they have bought all the leaders they are the people that impose the people that will lead us even from our hanese today to even to the uh or even ordinary uh motopake leader is being appointed by fulani even though the so called uh, listen uh, traditional rulers are being appointed by fulani the president of Ohanese is being appointed by, by Fulani. The, uh, the, the U2A uh, leader in Biafra land has been appointed by Fulani. So these people, they have really, uh, they have really do their mathematics very well and also put their, place, their people in place that are working for them. But unfortunately, Chuko Kabdama showed them that he is the God. You see, because uh, sometimes, People, human beings, when they plan their things, when we think their things, we think that uh, that is uh, most of most people play. They try to play the role, the role of God, but God, being who He is, being the omnipotent and omniscient God, who sees the heart of every uh, man and who know, who knows the beginning from the end. So He Himself was already know all His plan, and then He already uh, made a uh, kept aside His servant that we use at this prop, uh, at this particular time. When no, Onyendu no, started this uh, uh, message on the radio Biafra, many of us don't understand what it was, what was happening. We just mm, listen to it and then pass away. As on the, most of most of the time, even his message is I listen it more than ten times before I can be able to grab the real message. Then. So that is that's how that's how it is. So uh, we should be if we that is every Biafra should be supposed to be the happiest people that the people, people now. To, that is for us to have somebody like Nandikan because many religions in the in, in that part of the world desire to have somebody like him to have somebody like him just like now that uh, uh dream have been fulfilled in the year of now that giving them somebody like 
so black sunday and the and the and the great gani uh adam the people that can be able to speak the mind of the poor people so that is what we need at this proper time not the people that will sit claiming to be representing us while they have sold us somebody like uh, all the leaders of Ohanese, uh somebody like weekend and they and the river state and the input uh, the, the supreme court uh, governor in imo state all those people they are not there for us so um, fellow dear friends and the lovers of freedom and the friends of dear friends i don't want to take much of our time but in my uh, before i conclude i just want to say that everybody that is now that that, that, that uh, love freedom, no matter where you are. Even that it's not important that it must be a it must be black or it must be the African. As far as you love freedom, no matter from the country you are, we appreciate all of you. And the, because I believe many people that are not even even the are supporting even the struggle more than even the African. So I pray that any place you are, may Elohim bless you and also continue giving the courage to continue supporting this government. And also to be a friends, it is our duty to support our ESN, the uh, NGOs that God have brought to deliver us from the oppressor, the Fulanis. So uh, I want to uh, thank our, even all our members here in Russia Federation. There are many people that are uh, here in Russia, they pretend as if they don't know what is happening, but the message has passed to them. Yeah, to them. It is time for all of us to join hand to support this great movement and also to finance ESN. So that we can be able to go home uh, soonest. Uh, may Elohim bless all of us as we continue to you know, partake in this great uh, project that the people have given to us. I'm signing off from here. Uh, so, Russia Federation, thank you for having me. Yes. Thank you very much, my dear brother. And uh, may the Most High continue to strengthen you. Thank you very much. And uh, we must continue. <laughs> was created to be united But Nigerians and Britain Will divide us to rulers Said we are south, it's a south, south But we know we are all the friends The British Nigerians are crying That we are friends, you need to leave But we love to the people Caller, you are live on air right now. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Prism should be Desmond. Yes, Martin. Okay. Good morning from here. Welcome, my dear brother. Thank you. Thank you, Martin. Okay. My name is Desmond and I'm calling from Italy. Good morning, dear friends. IPOB family members worldwide. Martin, okay, you, our presenters. God bless you all, you, Ike Peters, Ike Chuku, and all of you. You know, you guys are really doing well. And I'll leave them as in the canoe. I salute you, I salute you from my end. God will bless you, strengthen, and guide and protect you in everything. That at the end, you will surely lead us to promised land, and victory shall be ours. Um, Mazi Wachineke, um, you've really done well this morning, and um, You've touched a lot of things, which is a matter of very important to this our struggle. And but before I go into that, please, be friends in Italy. Let me first of all bring to our notice or give us the numbers um, to support ESN from IPOB national body here in Italy. 
sent by the IPB national coordinator in Italy. Please, if you are a Biafran, friends of Biafran, or any group affiliated to Biafran, please and please rise up and support ESN. As long as you are in Italy, do call these numbers and support ESN. Um, the numbers are plus three nine three five one zero zero four six six zero five five. I repeat, plus three nine three five one zero zero four six zero five five. This number is for the IPUB national coordinator in Italy. The second number is plus three nine three five one two five five one two seven four. I repeat, plus three nine. Three five one two five five one two seven four. This number is for the IPOB National PRO in Italy. Please call any of this number and you'll be directed on how to support ESN for Bia France in Italy, please. Now, as it your this morning, you've really touched a lot of things, you know. Um I will start from let me start by at least trying to maybe expand to our people what is going on to an extent. I know we might have, in fact, not we might, we have some stupid people in the North who claim to be easy or this thing, who are so foolish. But I want to tell you that also, some of our ordinary people in the North are also getting the message because um, there is nobody that has been in the North that will say that place has been good. It, before even IPOB came to board, the North has but been a dead zone for SND our people. Bo. My brother, uh, but their SND bo uh, said that they want the they want their Nigeria. The SN in their communique is in Vanguard. I decided not to read it out yes. because uh, the contents. I don't want to say all those things. They uh, said that, that the is, whole that SND is, bo's in the 19 Northern uh, uh, State of the Zoological Republic. They want uh, their Nigeria to continue on, you know, and whatever nonsense. They yes, it's a. Uh, Yes, yes, that, that that is where I'm going, Mas. These are individuals, you know. These are these are people like um, the likes of um, the Sarikin Flanyo of Imo State, the likes of um, David Umahi of Ebony State, the likes of Mwike of uh, the place they call River State Iguacha, and then the rest of them, you know, the likes of Nyangoto. These are their likes now. Well, you, you don't. That is what I want to clear to our people, you know, because these people. The, these Fulani people, they bring these people together and they write something covering the whole people, you know, as if they are speaking for the people. They are not speaking for the people, you know. They are speaking for their pockets. Even for their family, they are not speaking because some of their family members are always against all these things they are doing. And let me also say something. Do you know that before now, the people, the, now they said uh, SND, but they did not say Hanese. Do you know the people the Fulani used to pass this kind of message before? This kind of the, uh, the detrimental message to against our people is Johannes and Dibu. But now they have seen that anything they any any statement they issue out and call Johannes and Dibu will be only that name is going to rubbish the whole thing. That was why in this statement they did not use Johannes and Dibu. They now they were now using S and Dibu 19. Is in Dibo. What, what, what is that? What is that? Is why sometimes Dibo does it when we say because some people in Jesus, Jesus, these are stupid men. Are, are you with me, Mas? Are you getting my message? Yeah, I'm, I'm listening. So, our, yes, our our dear friends in the north must understand that these men are demons, and they don't mean well for them. And that is if at all, if they are. Uh, because sometimes, you know, these people, they generate some idiots, put some names there, unverifiable names and all those things there. You know, because sometimes when this kind of thing is happening, you know, you will see a video. They will make a video to show. You, you know, Fulani now, these people there, you know, they like to defy. So they will do the video. They will make it that all the whole world will see it. Like when the world was saying, if you, before you kill a Fulani man, please, first kill me. They did a video and they spread it around. You understand now? So this kind of thing, they will do a video. They will want the whole world to see it. But as long as it's something written, sometimes oh here konu kore konu kore But then we are not we are not trying to maybe take anything for granted or anything. We are telling our people in the north that you don't listen to anybody. You have been marked out for extermination. You want to leave? Come back to your place. Leave the north. When there is still make haste when the sun shines, leave the north and come back and leave. 
Forget about those people who are there talking that nonsense. They should stay there and die. Like the man that had the police session you talked earlier about, um, that idiot, that said, Bama Magana, Biafra, now. The following week, they cut off his head, the idiot. And that is the now. Who has taken it? Because his family will not... Will if you allow the family to get there? The police station, they have taken the police station. Very stupid men. So those are the kind of people that come out to sell this nonsense them. So our people should not listen to them. These are maybe one, one or two, two men. They hold no water. Nobody listens to them. Nobody knows them. It's certain. Our people are living in the north out of necessity because of life, because they have to survive. Nobody will want to be in the north. I lived in the north. I know what we face there with my whole family. My family had to divide into two. One part went to the east, another part went to Lagos. Then there was no IPOB. But the heat has always been on. The killing has always been there. Let them go. There was 19, before 19, before 1970, there was one of our sister that we do share her, her videos now that said the Afra must come. She said her grandfather was sliced like, like bread. The video is still going around. You know, in the north. The problem in the north. How can our people forget so soon? The death has been coming from the north to our people. So our people must understand that the north is a, is a dead zone for us. And they have to live and relocate. Even though no matter how what the insecurity they are trying to bring in our land, but God will surely see us through that our land will be secured. That's why we are calling on everybody to make sure that they join hand with us and support ESN. And every village, every group in Biafra land must also, I, 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 youths must also form vigilante and keep watch of their villages, their communities, and their towns and their cities also. It's very, very important because ESN cannot be everywhere at all times. But you must have a credible vigilant and have the necessary connection in case of assistance or support or backup. It's very, very important. You know, so our people must wake up. There is war in our land. And Igbo man, as long as Igbo, it's not even Igbo, Biafra. Even I say even Biafra, even you are Igala, because they don't know you, they will just say, look and see, tiny. all of you are the same. So once you are you are not part of this planet, or should I say outside to an extent, they know that the, the aim of Fulani is to kill you. And this government is now spearheading the whole thing. And our people must yeah, rise up and make haste. Are you talking to me, Mazi? Yeah, just round up. Another person is already on call. I okay, okay, to, okay. Telling him to yeah, 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 thank you very much, Mazi. So, so that is my message for our people this morning. It's very, very important that our people understand that um, the situation is very tense. And all we need to do now is to ignore some things. Um, coming from some people, especially these are our political people, the people that call themselves ACs and whatever thing they call themselves and then defend our land is very, very important. Our life is very important now. We cannot, 1970 to 70, we died because of what? Because we had no media. Now we have media. And I want to say something about BBC. Our people must understand that BBC, just, BBC no, Pigeon, no, no, these are our no, enemies. Yeah, let me take this call. He had been waiting. Yeah, uh, uh, call okay. on the line. Uh, Thank you very tell much, us your name and where you are calling from. Uh, you have been holding. Uh, Desmond, I have to. Hello, can you hear me, brother? Hello? Yeah, you are live on air right now. You have been waiting. Okay, I said my name is Imanya. Imanya is calling from Russia. You are welcome, brother. I want to continue. I want to contribute on the issue of uh, uh, of uh, our people in the north. Sometimes our people in the north may not likely to go to those kind of call. Because when you are when you, when you live in the north, you will, sometimes you behave like them. I have lived in the north. Some people don't even know what is going on. They only wake up in the morning and go back to their shop, come back in the night and sleep. They don't even ask. They don't even want to even care. And I said, that's why, that's why sometimes if war happens, anything happens, some of them lost their life because they don't know what is going on. If you listen to radio, you have to listen to IPO. Tell your brother, tell your uncle, like some people that I used to tell. If I tell them, they say they don't even know what is going on. Understand that kind of and the world has gone beyond that. What is supposed to be on social media? Know what is going on? 
not when they are killing their people. You understand? But if you stop all this nonsense, they cannot speak our mind. We have seen the light. We know what is happening in the, in the whole world. You understand? They can't speak. They are just speaking on their on, 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 on their behalf and their children. Not we. Even their children may not buy the idea. You understand? Come to this uh, Richard, um, 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 this way, because I don't know in the state. You must go down. Because you cannot kill our commander. Kill everybody. Kill our people. Finish. We will return to make peace. It can never happen. And this, uh, what this Fulani is that uh, I saw on Facebook, saw on uh, internet, they captured some Fulani. Many of them, they said they did not have weapon and they, they had it in Some are heading to Enugu. Some say they will catch some people at Enugu, holding them with all these soldiers. They should not take it easy with these people. Their weapons will be around. All this, uh, their, 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 all this, their, their uh, allergy and crew that has money around that, that area. They may pack their weapons there, all this their most. Our people should wake up and, and be watchful. So that they may not sleep, these people will turn overnight and strike them. You understand? So that's my contribution this morning. Thank you very much, my brother. Thank, Thank you. you very much, brother, for making it a snap. Let's take this call. Kola, you are live on air right now. Uh, tell us your name and where you're calling from. My name is Mwachineke. Good morning. This is Sonia Dede. Sonia Dede, welcome. How are you, you doing, bro? Yeah. Yeah. How's everything? it has been a long time. Hope everything is going normal with you. Uh, by the grace of Jehovah Elohim. Hello? Thank God. Okay. Okay, fellow dear friends, I just want to sing this song before I make my little comments. Yes, and it's chasing our criminals in our land, in Biafra land. Yes, so far we are truly messed up. But right now we are fully secure. Words cannot tell how I feel about the things you are doing for us. And you're struggling to stand for our rights. We say thank you for protecting Biafra land. Yeah. You'll be fighting so hard, protecting more land against the full and knees, enemies of Biafra land. The area of the soldiers that we know want to save guide and keep us safe. If it's not for IMP, you'll be telling me, where do I go? If not for ESN, where do we stand? If not for IP, you'll be telling me, where do I go? If not for ESN, where do we stand? IPOB. Thank you, ESN. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, IPOB. Thank you, ESN. That, thank you, our leader, Mazin Namdi Kano, for the really great job. Most of you guys that are into music yeah. and they're singing for Biafra, I wish I would just have one day, just organize a program with you guys. You people are trying. Very, very important. And um, we will be trying our yeah, best that, to make sure that, that would we, be great, my brother. We, we, we sing that our, would be great. Uh, uh, your, uh, uh, we, 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 we use your music for our broadcast. Very, very important. I would like maybe one day like that. All of you will just come maybe on Zoom or on Skype or wherever. Just have one full program for you. One day. We'll have to organize that. Continue, okay. brother. Okay, no problem. Okay, no problem. Thank you for that offer. And I will let our groups to know if it will, yeah, we will plan for it. So I want to tell you, fellow, thank you, fellow Bia France, all over the whole world for all of your good work. Today, everybody is witnessing what is happening, all because of Maz, IPOB and our leader, Mazin Namdekano. I just come across a, um, a write-up, maybe from the Miyati Anla. They are saying that the, that, uh, that the silence of our leader, Mazin Namdekano, is so scary for them, because they don't know the next plan. So they know that something is happening. I, I keep wondering why our people who are not really keyed in. Hello? Are you there? For IPOB. Okay, continue. For continue. IPOB, yeah, I'm still here. Yeah, for IPOB is doing a wonderful work. The enemies are witnessing it all the time. Um, the full are doing all they can, trying to infiltrate our land. Uh, uh, two days ago, or uh, yesterday, news break that about 73 of them that we are coming to Biafra land with their bikes, 
we are intercepted at uh, Benu, uh, uh, around Benua State, uh, State side. What are they coming to do in Imo State? Hope Zodima is truly want to destroy our land, but we shall see in the end of everything. So fellow beer friends, I said, keep up the good work. Don't lose hearts. God is on our side fighting all of our battles. Uh, our brothers all over the whole world, make it your aim to keep on supporting ESN because I can't just tell you how I feel right now because of ESN. They are the soldiers that we know around Biafra. Do all you can to support ESN. I would like to hang it here until next time. God thank bless you, sir. Thank you very much, my dear brother. Thank you very much. Let's take this call. Call I bring you back. Uh, you are live on there right now. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Can you hear me? Hello. Yeah, welcome, you have the mic. Yeah, yeah, good morning. Welcome. Yeah. Yeah, I'm calling I'm calling from Taraba State. Welcome. Yeah, I'm calling for the behalf of Sorry, I can't hear you be a bit. Hello? Yeah, I can hear you now. Continue. Right on. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm calling from Taraba State. Oh, Taraba State. Welcome. How is Taraba? Yeah, Taraba State. Taraba is fine. Good. I'm very, I'm very happy. We are, we are very happy for what uh, Nambi Kalo is doing. Good. What's your name? You didn't tell us your name. Yeah. Hey, my name is Hamir. My name is Hamir Hanus. Samuel Hanus. Hello. Uh, the line went off. Let's take another call. Uh, he's calling from Taraga State. It's like, um, uh, I think it should be Chine. Do, Chine, do you are live on there right now? I'm hearing your, yeah. your background. Can you hear yes. me? Yes, Mazi. Yes, Can I go on? Yeah, right on. You have the mic now. You have been calling. Yeah, I'm watching. I'm watching. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much for picking my call. My Elohim, Chukwokadio, my bloody, my brother. And you too. Mazi, how are you doing this morning? Uh, by the grace of Elohim, we are bouncing well. Yes, Mazi, we are so grateful for your for your good work. I mean, Mazi, Mazi, we, do you know we their friends are so blessed? When sometimes when I listen to you, you know, chewing this our language, you know, my brother, my heart is full of joy for letting these people know what what the plan of Fulani, how Fulani has conquered them. To use them to kill their own fellow human beings. Houses, the normal houses are not so. I mean, these people are not like Fulani. But thank God today you can use this language to talk to them. Some of them know their eyes have opened. They have known that these Fulani have used them to destroy their own people. At the end of the day, they, beca they became slaves in their own land. Their houses should wake up. Houses people should wake up. 
Simon will bless all of you. Mercy, thank you, Amma Jaka, the IPOB National Arugo. Thank you, my, my, my brother, for picking my call. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. That's thank our you, good brother, Mazi Chinidaka, from Austria. Let's take this call. Caller, you are live on air right now. Uh, your name and where you are calling from. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, I'm watching that Can morning. you tune down your device? Sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. I've done that. I've done that. All I right, didn't even know right that. Right Thank you, my brother. Thank you. All help you, Afra. All help you, Land of the rising sun, we must, we, land of the rising sun, we love and cherish. Beloved homeland of our brave heroes, we must defend our lives or we will cherish. We, we. What's wrong? What happened with your line? Just went off. What happened? Uh, let's take this announcement first. Uh, it's from IPOB in Sweden. in Sweden and in Scandinavia, lovers of freedom all over the world, you can join our Zoom meeting slash fundraising. Post, IPOB in Sweden. Date, 27th of June 2021. All beer friends in Sweden need to come together for this Zoom fundraising meeting to support Eastern Security Network, so that our land will be secured for our mothers and fathers to farm, and our women won't be raped and our land won't be taken away by foreigners. This is for all beer friends and lovers of freedom and it will hold on Sunday 27th of June 2021. Venue will be on Zoom. Meeting ID 305-653-0857. The passcode is 6JXTBV. It will also be shared in all platforms. Thanks. For more information if you want to donate to Eastern Security Network via IPOB Sweden, you can call Marcy Stanley on plus 467657539842. Or Marzi Kingsley on plus four six seven three seven five five one nine three nine. Thank you for your support. That is IPOB Sweden organizing a fundraising on twenty seventh of this month. And the venue is on Zoom. The Skype ID, the Zoom ID had been mentioned, and uh, the numbers had been called. Make sure you part and parcel of it. This is the way we must continue to press on to make sure that Biafra is being restored. You have not supported uh, um, ESN. This is the time you must do that. Very, very important. We don't have any other people, if not the ESN. ESN is there to defend our land. Remember that the ginger weed, uh, the the Al uh, Shabab and um, Al Qaeda's and the repentant Boko Haram's and whatever are already now in uniform, in the military uniform, and they are killing us, our young youth, and nobody's reporting. BBC will not report it. Uh, CNN will not report it. Even your so-called the Igbo BBC also can't report it. So it is only us that will save ourselves. Never think or believe that somebody from somewhere will come and help you. All those beliefs are folk tales. They are myths. Don't believe in those things. We fight it by ourselves consistently and we'll get it. So make sure you are part. You, if you are living within Scandinavia or you have not supported um, ESN for the first time or you have done, but uh, Elohim is blessing you, please be part of it. It's coming up this month, 27th of this month make sure you are part of it this is radio biafra as a service to coming to you from the platform of radio biafra london under the leadership of one and only onion do mazin namdekano or hamadike one of biafra land in case you are not aware mazin namdekano is the only incorruptible leader of the indigenous people of biafra he's the director of radio biafra and her television and he's the commander of the armies of biafra and uh, we must continue. Let's take this call. I'm the kind of from Mr. Hull World. Here we 
is true to destroy Nigeria. Cause they said we are misclass people. They didn't know we are freedom fighters. Babylon to the people. All hell be a friend. God bless our fathers. All right, yeah, come on the line. You are back. Uh, tell us your name and where you are calling from. Thank you, Mazi. Thank you, Mazi. That was a uh, I'm the interruption. My name is Ozemena. My name is Ozemena Mazi. I'm from Umo Bomini Dato in Olu province, Biafra land. Land of the rising sun. We love and cherish beloved homeland of our brave heroes. We must defend our lives or we shall perish. We shall protect our lives from all our foes, but if the price is dead for all we hold there, then let us die without a shred of fear. All hell be afra. Mazi, the things the things that is happening in our land this time around, it is it, it, it is very, very obvious that our leader Mazi Nam Dekano and the IPOB and the ESN has been vindicated in all ramifications. Our people, our people in the north, we have been shouting for our people in the north to come back, for our people who are living in the north, who lives in the north. I don't know whether, I don't know whether these people, I, I don't know whether they, they, they just decided to sacrifice their lives for Biafra to come, or they, they are waiting when, when these people will start killing them so that they will, run, they will start running Hector Sketa. Nothing mega. <laughs> Andy, you know, there. Ma, 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 there is nothing like AZ, bro. Those people are those people are breeded, those people are animals breeded by the Fulanese. They are nothing like AZ, bro. Those people are animals who have been breeded by the Fulanese. But forget I don't I'm, I don't want to talk about them because our lead our leader have said it openly. They, if they if they decided to live there and to, to fill other months, that means they want to be a sacrificial lamb. Then let me come to Imo State. Let me come to Imo State, the insecurity in Imo State. Who opposed them have decided to, to talk on Imo State as another Bonu in Nigeria? That is what who opposed them is doing in our state, in Imo State now. Who opposed them has been misinformed about the about what Imo State stands for. Who opposed them have killed the council, have killed many, many innocent Biafrans in Imo State. Now he is asking for peace. Co-opposed of them snatched the gubernatorial seat belong to belong to Ihedioha. If who opposed of them want peace in Imo State, who opposed of them will first give the seat to who it belongs to, bring the consul alive, bring all the Biafrans who opposed of them have killed. He will go and bring them alive, bring them, we will see them physically so that we will know how to do peace with who opposed of them. No peace for the wicked. Operan kwa ho yoron gwe oro. Hopos of them must dance the, the, the must dance to the truth of Biafrans. He will, he will never have peace in his life till the day he comes we have them in his hand to, to judge him. Hopos of them is a murderer and he must go down. That is what I have to tell you. All her Biafrans. All her Biafrans. Correct and direct. That is it. Uh, even if Hope Zodima resigned or run away, he must pay with his blood. Whether people uh, forgive him or you don't forgive him, that is, the man has crossed the line with him and other governors. You cannot kill us and one ask us. Listen, if you don't react, they will, they will react on you. And the time for that has come. This is our time. Uh, we must fight it till the end. It doesn't care whatever is happening. Uh, let's take this call. Call, are you alive on air right now? Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Good morning. Welcome, my dear brother. Mazi, good morning. My name is Ikech uh, I hear from Ikechkwo Boy in Oka, South Local Government, Biafra Land. I'm residing here in Libra Field. Mazi, I thank you for all that you are doing for Biafra restoration. Mostly my thank goes to our leader, Mazim Nande Kanu. You know, he's, he's silent, he's scared to the Aosafulanese and the rest of uh, others. 
when he talk, they are scared. When he's silent, they are scared. That is that is to show you that they are, what we are doing is not in vain. And probably we have price is always at hand. We have already in the only we are now we are waiting the day that we are part of the announce. Coming to the so-called uh Ibo's and you know they are sacrificial lamb. They want to talk the language that they will understand. Kakeni when the suna what animal the suna kasari wa and chem su dao su dao su kish mu dao. Zaya bunan de suai, da keshe sua uli. Say saraka de su Hello? Right on, brother. Kachigaba. Hello? Kachigaba de Magananka. Naji. Oh. Najinka. Oh. Uh. Uh. Akasuke. Baba <laughs> Then we catch a coming over the one Ika 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 pay a Kasa a Kasa Nigeria Gabada, several the Bamudamu de Suba, several the Haka, Monigamu Munzona, Mun Munsia Ujamu, Ba when they say no shaking, several the one the Dashi Dashi Bazay says, but my mind is Bazay, Bazay, Bashi, 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 your line is fainting. I'm not hearing you. Yeah. Okay. Continue now. I can hear you now. <laughs> Something is wrong with your line, brother. I don't know. Should be your network. Let's take this call. Caller, you are live on air now. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Yeah, well, very good uh, morning to you, my own brother. What's making the world? Welcome, my dear brother. Good. Good. From, uh, thank you. I'm from, from my area, from my location. Good. Uh, my in the world, the world, especially in Osotua. I also want to appreciate our brother who came and speak to um, the the house outside and i'm so turning my 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 voice to our singer who came to sing i think uh Marzi, everyone that speaks this morning speaks with a lot of wisdom and with a lot of hope and with a lot of um enthusiasm that Biafra is just around the corner but Marzi, because they have said it all i just want to ask this word from my leader we are in the 17th of our prayer. We are mood of praying. Now, let me remove my cap for all of it. Our leader tweeted today, I'm just going to read, um, I don't want to read from the whole psalm. Let me just read from the portion that our leader uh, tweeted. The only that particular verse that he tweeted. On our day 17. But on number seven, our leader find it very necessary for we to do very well on 17. The 17 says 17 verse 7. Swore, swear, so, so, so thou marvelously loving kindness, O Chukoki Kabyama, that thou savest by their right hand, when then which put their trust in thee. For those that raise against them, they, they, they are what he's trying to say here is that uh, the Chukuk Kabyam have risen to save those who trust in him and to show the Fulani health men what um, the people of Biafra mean for him. 
You understand? So all the people that have risen against us, and they are worried about why our leader is not talking. Our leader is talking. Our leader is talking in parables. When Jesus was here, when they asked him questions, he answered. Most of the time he answered, he answered in parables. And people were, is uh, this man speaking in parable? And they didn't understand that after so many years, of over 2,000 years, those words that Jesus was being said, we are all seeing the impact of what he was saying. And it is happening now. But there is a part that our people have not learned. And when Peter draw his sword, he said, no, it's not time for Saul and arrow. When the time of Saul and arrow comes, he said to them, it is time, go into the city, buy something to defend yourself. If you don't have money, say something that you have and go and buy something to defend yourself. Fellow beer friends, if you're in diaspora, support your people at home to make sure they buy something to support themselves. I personally uh, don't live in uh, talking without doing. I spoke to my stepbrother, Ufunnechi, Ufunnechi, and Naonicha, told him what our leader said, because I see some of these people are not listening to the background of what our leader is saying. And then I tell him what we need to do, and they are doing the need for. And I'm also telling our people in diaspora, support your people at home. Support them to buy something to defend themselves. That is the time Jesus was talking in parable. And that time is here. And the prayer that Jesus prayed about the returning of the kingdom of heaven on earth, that time to buy something to defend it is here. If you don't understand our leader, our leader is just not a human being. Our leader is sent by God. Though he was born through the king, but he is a man that is been sent by God, separated from every human being. Do not take his word so light. Whatever he says to me is a law. Stop using what's up. Leave your tongue to the bush. Mazi, let me use one minute of your time to tell our people something I think they refuse to know. We've been in this struggle. I've been in this struggle when I was looking at the foolish and then stupid elderly man who has decided to deceive his people and lead us to death. Started this in a good age. I was staying two billion away from him. I was part of the people who have died in this struggle earlier. When we were wearing white, written Masob, marching from my two to Alab International, so many people were killed. Now, let me tell our people where we are. Where we are now, we are in the middle of war. The war has no rules of engagement, the type of war we are. I ask you a question who that is listening to me? Diaspora, or you are in Biafra land, or you are in Nigeria? How much food have you prepared for your people if this war have, have to last for two months or three months? If you have to be in the bush, how much water have you gathered? If you have to hide yourself from somewhere with your two, three children and your family and your wife, how much have you gathered to make sure that hungry will not kill them? Do you know we are doing the talking even though we are far away? We are paying heavily in for Eastern, we are paying monthly dues heavily. We are paying things that we need to pay to make sure that you guys are sustained. But the most thing that we can give to you is to tell you what you need to do to stay alive for us. How much have you gathered? How much weapon have you bought? What have you done to protect your people? If those people that died in Imo State, if they hear this word of ours, that this man, this gentleman, Wachinek, have been preaching for years, saying go and buy something defend yourself i was with him telling him you are saying it the way it is continue saying it if they heard our words and they buy something to defend themselves and when that full animal in a uniform comes to kill him he killed him before he killed him don't you think he's going to die an honorable death what is wrong with him i don't worry about the aces those aces in ugausa and those ones aces in lagos 
and so many places who doesn't want to support what we are doing. You know what happens? Go and read history. You will pay dairy for every word that come out of your mouth during this time that we have lost over 5 million in 1967 till 1975. We lost a lot of people. I ran away from Mugawasa, if you don't know. I ran for Mugawasa in 1982. Before this usual body came into the picture, it is not today they start killing us. Be wise and wake up to the reality. May Elohim make this world come into you and may it bring the fruit to why it is said. Thank you. Thank you very much, my dear brother. Thank you Thank for you. your wonderful you, contribution. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. You made mention, you made touch about, thank, thank God you live in the north. At least uh, when you are speaking, you are speaking out of experience. I can't see the reason why. Why, why we are saying this thing regarding those in the north? For you not to listen to all these uh, so-called S and D book or whatever. These are not. It's just because of their houses they build there. Just because of their houses, and they don't know how it's going to be. Even here on Radio Biafra, our leader has given the lectures how it should be. If Biafra come, it will be one of the state in Ecowas, and that is the easiest way you get your property. But still, you can still listen. All of you will be sacrificed there. But those of you who they are your leaders, they are your aces, you know, you have to listen to what we are telling you. You must not follow their way. You must not follow their way. Begin to arrange yourself because the killing will start in the north very soon. By the time the change away is tried all they want to do and it didn't work, their last option is to begin to kill you people. This is Radio Biafra House Service. To call you are live on air right now. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Caller, can you hear me? Good morning, sir. Welcome, my dear brother. Yeah, my name is Monday. I'm calling from uh, Zoological Republic. I'm agenda. You are welcome, brother. Sorry, <laughs> Thank you very much, my dear brother. Thank you for the quick one. One thing they must have in mind is that we will not forgive them. If Rondi Abura, our people, uh, let the, whether they like, if whether he like, let him resign or not. The man need to die. Let him go and hang himself. With other governors, like Mwike that bragged, Mwike will die. Omai will die. Obiano will die. These people signed the killing of our people. We will not forgive them. Let them do it now. You are live on air right now, caller. Tell us your name and where you are calling from, if possible. Uh, brother, uh, uh, former governor of Manam Prasti. Uh, uh, can I say, somebody is nonsense on our corner. I got your coaching for the moon for your mercy now, so I am sending a bro and now on a whole on two guys separate ya from Nigeria. We see country we kept the power for them caught we kept like Nigeria before. A country without evil, Nigeria is nothing without their friends. Nigeria is nothing, and they knew that without Nigeria, without Biafra, nothing will work in Nigeria. But they are handling us as if we are nobody. Let them be caught. There will be my nursing. Oh, well, if indeed when they may go, and have a mother, don't wait for a mother. That's about this people, but I need to read it because they are not a half. On your PIA, I have to move, I have to anything. Only back up. Oh, we are done. We couldn't open them. Open out a motor name, a child, no one like this. If we talk to Afro, who be Afro, and I can hear you. If I'm my hope, who's of him? Oh, now, Biafra, what I do, Pope Sodima, personally, I and my family will never forgive Pope Sodima. 
I'm coming. I'm calling from Biafra. My name is Isaac. But now all now who puts out him, everybody back here, more personally for what he has done. I can never forgive him in my life. I may come from Biafra, and I have the blood of Biafra. But what if I came and come back and look for some him? Be good. Can I have this politician? I'm not politics. Can I do? Don't do my day, man. Let's handle them once and for all. We are delaying. If I were to say we are still delaying. Uh, please, all help Biafra. All oh, help Biafra. That is it, my dear brother. Uh, Thank you very much. Uh, how many times can I get this now? I'm going to have a lot of money. What is the matter? I'm going to have a lot of money. Exactly. Exactly. Because and the, the more they are reducing us, the more we are going down. Let us just do this thing silently. We don't even need to to uh, uh, blow any trumpet and say uh, today we want to fight war. No, let's behave as old Igbo people. I am Baba Hofu. I am Baba Hofu. Mamo to many to encounter them with Mamo to many to no one can get a Okay, all you go and you need to to go and you need to meet everybody. We don't have no account. Remember that no no witness, no case. Honest, no witness, no case. That is what I believe. It's enough. Don't you hope for that, Emma? Don't know this people in the area. You know, on a job, I'm watching it in bed. In a haka, every day they are killing us. Every day they are killing us. She make a brazilian man no gunman because of how another kind of this is the kind of people. I walk at that and see the government can get to enjoy no ESN. As soon as I go, I go, I go, I go. Even it's okay. This one send the message, send them my number. I want to join. As I'm going now, I'm inside my car. I'm feeling okay. I'm a, I'm an engineer, but I I will never I will still fight. I'm out to fight. Honestly, I'm out to fight these people. Don't care what the full and yellow how many people. I never use to pray. Professional said the guy. What if the full and yellow full and yellow fools? What if the full and yellow full and yellow? No entities. So what if I have? They are nobody. They are using our brain. Onto what? Enough is enough. Whether outside people want to accept, whether they don't want to accept, let's just fight our own cause. Thank God for our brothers, Yorubas. Let us join together and fight these people once and for all. We are not afraid of anything. We have men. Let's catch these people once and for all and deal with them. I don't need to to say, uh, 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 can I mention the other side of the war? No, the war has started. Then let's go on secret killings. If we can do it secret, we know that to have the war. Thank you, my brother. God bless you. Thank you very much, brother. Keep it up. That yes. is it. Yeah. Yeah. Right yeah. Thank you very much. Let's take this call. Let's yeah. take this call. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Thank you very much, brother. Thank you. Kola, you are live on air. Uh, uh, Jack, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, good morning from here. You are welcome, brother. How are you doing? Thank you. And thank God today. Good morning, dear friends and lovers of freedom. Uh, we'll continue to pray our our psalm. I think today is uh, Psalm 18. And we get to verse uh, 34. You clearly will see what the word of God said there. So having said that, uh, uh, the, the the weapon of our warfare is not kind of as all of us know and it's mighty to the pulling down of every stronghold. I think uh, on the issue of those of our people who are in the north, uh, we have said a lot. I think we we'll also be continuous saying. Yeah, we need to say. Do, you, do do you know why, Pastor Jack? Do you know these are coming from the mouths of the so-called? Uh, the 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 self-acclaimed S and D over there, because some people will be looking up to them, believing in them. Whereby, if they will listen to us, they will be saved before the rock exactly. will come. You know, so that is why we need to echo it. And if it's just ordinary exactly. people, I wouldn't have worried. These are the others that may meet them in their rural meetings, in their village meetings over there, telling them no more if any man no sin he can then against if any man ban all those things on that day. I bet so far, you know, because they're listening to the so called um, our self acclaimed as because I am where is that one is very certain, right? On brother, exactly, exactly. That is that is one thing. Uh, even some, you know, some some similar minded people gathered and said they are now not an ibos, they are just deceiving some persons. But I want to let them know 
some of us have stayed in the north for a very long time. Me, I stayed in I stayed in Kano. I was in Kano. In fact, I went to Taroni, Taroni Secondary School in Kano. I stayed in Zoo Road, Hamza Titi. From there, I went to Ibo Road, Ibo Road, Ibo Road by, uh, by Gold Coast, Tabongeri. So I stayed in Kano very, very well. So, and we were working in, uh, I think, at Bombay, this uh, Tower Governance product then, before they started this, uh, at that time they started Boko Haram newly. Do you know that we made up our man that we living in Kano? Immediately we left Kano, that company was bombed. And if they even kill white people, Immediately we left Kanu, used the trailer to move our load back home. They keep this, they bomb that company. So it's, it doesn't matter what you have in Kanu. Nobody's going to take your belongings. You must be alive before you talk about belongings. So if we are beginning to tell you, we are telling you this thing on a daily basis, you don't want to hear. You are a necessary casualty. If they kill you, nothing will happen. Nobody, because, because. Those of them that may not that may not go, except except they are they are except they are members of this family because we can fight from anywhere we are. But if you if if you are not, you need to relocate and come back home because what you are doing there, you can do it home. So if anybody, any set of people or group of people are coming today, you nothing know, will happen. Not when that thing will happen, hey, they will be the first people that will disappear. You don't know that they have their option B, their plan B already, but they are deceiving you. Really, anything happens, fam, you see them. Some of them will run away, and you will die. This is a casualty. So, first of all, we must have to uh, protect our land, the Afrika land first, before we go and fight outside. You must know that too. So, whatever you are doing is up to you to know. Uh, so, having, uh, having said that, I think the issue of politicians and those keeping us working with the enemy, we can no longer overemphasize what we have to do with them. The battle line has been dropped. I think Finally, I got money. I grew. I got you. So it's no longer the issue of talking too much. This time around, our silence is going to be golden. We will do what we want to do. They continue to commit the genocide in our in our land because all the so-called politicians have a hand in the killing going on in our land, and none of them will go scot free. Either if they don't pay now, they will pay anytime soon. But the rest are sure that they are going to pay. So it doesn't matter. They can go and have hundreds of meetings and say they are jargon and pledge to their one one Nigeria one flurry. That is just their pocket. But for we, the indigenous people, there is nothing that will stop the the, the restoration of Biafra. Nothing. There is nothing. You know one good thing about all this whole thing. We have just make it known to the world. We are not importing any single ammunition. Everything will be designed here and we will defend this land. We are going to declare Biafra. You will see it. So we have just given them all it takes, the time frame and everything, to be civil because we have been peaceful all along. And the international community can bear this record. Everybody can bear this record. Why they continue to kill our people? And for the death of us and even other people. You people should wait. You are going to see the salvation of the Lord. They can dance, they can do whatever thing. But there's no peace for the wicked. It doesn't matter what you do. It doesn't matter your contact. It doesn't matter. But you know, the might and the will of the people is greater, subdue every other thing you are coming up with. And in the end, all of them will pay their dues. Biafra shall come, no man shall stop Biafra. Watch it, can I just, all I have this morning to add. Thank you and God bless Biafra. Thank you very much, my dear brother, and keep it up. That is it, we must continue. Uh, uh, let me read a sentence from this, the uh, communique. The communique was jointly signed by the President General of Igbo Delegate Assembly, IDA, Chief Chi Mwogo, Chairman of SNDBO in the 19 Northern States, and the FCT, Eze Pampas, Ngozi Wahe, and Eze Ndibo Kano, and the President of SNDBO in diaspora, everywhere Eze Eze, Eze Boniface, Ipekwe, these are the people, you know. You must not listen to these people. Uh, let's take this call, I presume, should be my dear brother, Eke Ronike. Brother, you are live on air right now. Yeah, one, uh, yeah, one uh, uh, good morning from Portland here. Yeah, I remember Eke Ronike here from Omaka in our province of Biafaland. Mazi, honestly, we appreciate our leader. Silent is good. Like one of our brothers said, Imana, I can't come here really. He ordered that he tell me, "Yola, 
we appreciate our leader very well. And we appreciate our UGM fanaticals, men of valor, volunteers all over the world. We appreciate all of you. Mas, all of us are volunteers so in our different forms. Mas, uh, your topic today, you are talking about. Mas, when Onyendo were telling them that Nigeria is the first, the, 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 the prediction, people couldn't believe it. But recently, I think two days ago, yesterday, Wikipedia just removed Nigeria. Wikipedia just finally removed Nigeria and replaces it with the Biafra as at Mazi Nandi Okokano. Mazi, there's something you said this morning. You are, you are talking about the military base. These are execution centers now. And likewise, every CPS, every police center in Biafra land, about Asabo, Mazi, I have a brother who just came in, came out for CPS Aba. This guy will tell that they're executing our people every minute of the day, especially when you, they find it as an eye pop, confirm, they kill you immediately. Every minute of the day, they're killing our people, they're wasting our people. But your BBC were not yeah. reporting it. Economic, your BBC Ibo, are not saying anything. <laughs> they are not even interviewing them. It's just maybe how help low baroque now. Has this regard to the live video? Go send them mad. Try here and give you. Yeah. Because mbagi video kwa 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 Nobody is hearing it. They are not talking. But no way, maybe American men make a mistake or whatever. If the idiots and the people they are sending are the same Igbo boys, Igbo people. That is why we are saying all these things. Your name could be um, Kelechi, Uchenna, Emeka, whatever. If anybody did not believe in the same ideology with you, that person need to go down. We are fathering things. Because these people are evil. They are like cancer to us, eating us gradually. You will not report the, the heinous crime the Al-Shabaab in uniform are doing in our land. You will not report it. But anything, whatever, that is what you, because they are paying you maybe 50,000 naira a month, or 100,000, to destroy your own people. There is no difference between you and the politicians and the so-called political leaders that they will bring to Abuja uh, 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 traditional rulers they bring to Abuja, lodge them in hotel, give them money, and the so called religious mm. leaders they will go to their churches and wherever their worship center <laughs> is and do thanksgiving. We must make this thing very clear because the war is already going on, and at war, at a certain level, they have started it, and we will start it also because the one inside you is more dangerous than the one outside. Poisoning cannot give me man who can be dangerous. Sorry, right on, brother. Yeah, much, but at the end of the day, they cannot kill all our people in Biafra land. <laughs> like you rightly said, those of us in diaspora, they know, do they know how many we are? And that is why Onion do tweeted today again, Mazi, that it does not matter how many they kill. But one thing is inevitable Biafra must be emerged. You understand the language? One thing is inevitable. It doesn't matter how many they kill us. One outcome is inevitable. Biafra must emerge. Every must emerge a free nation. And the 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 more the stable to us, the 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 ginger with the caliphs, the sooner the the caliphs understand this inevitability, the better for them. People are watching. The whole world is watching. And we thank God for our people in Twitter, and that's why we encourage our brothers, sisters, had coffin. Sure, you tweet 100, 200 every day. It doesn't take anything. Continue tweeting. It get it going far and wide. That's where we are decimating these people. I love those of them in Twitter doing wonderful work. Imagine, imagine our people are not going to. Our boys are not going to. It doesn't take Twitter. Doesn't take anything. Don't continue the tweeting. It doesn't take anything. It's going far and wide. Follow and the follow to and there are people you can follow. They all of them, but there are people are there. And there are people you can follow in Facebook, not every idiot you see in Facebook. You can follow Isaiah, but there are people who are making a very big impact in Facebook.
media for to follow them share what that gen because there are a lot of fake here and there now like uh, what the bleak that the agk bleak is doing and all of all of some all of they know they are saying so it's not about calling names but at the end of the dollar they will pay for it as for uh that uh, uh bleaching uh, governor in here bleaching uh, spring court they they put in him state we own that land but there's no too much talking even letting continue killing our people and dropping their cause here and there he killed the consul and he killed my brother too he killed my guy from America too he's an ESN member after the week how many people see the kind of killing he was dead and when we tell our people to go buy something to defend themselves some of them nothing is happening nothing mega but the and same, the same the people they are killing didn't you see the protest or whatever uh match or whatever would i call it I saw it in now. solidarity they did it last week or last two weeks and they did it again Major, uh, 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 is it this week or weekend that they are supporting uh administrator <laughs> hopes of them and they want peace to come whereby you have planted the tree of injustice you did not uproot it and you want peace to reign you see how foolish our people are brother we need to be uh, explaining all these things when Oyendu will come and tell you how useless a black man is, some people will get won't they can't be able to digest it. But look at it, it's happening real. Their own brother, one name okay, flesh and blood, the same state, the same local government, the same clan, the same whatever. The dead body is in FMC. Some of them they didn't even see the dead body, they throw inside water, whatever they did to them. In support of the Fulani caliphate they brought for you. To do this thing you are supporting him and you want peace to how can the peace reign you see how foolish our people are you want peace so that you'll be going to club every night and useless in your life drinking gold and water that's that is the only thing you see that will come out of there nothing Chemical. good again prostituting yourself where and there that is the peace you want whereby terrorists that have already been encircling your state gradually you see how foolish our people these are young you too i was just watching the thing on facebook <laughs> How much did they give them? Change that five thousand naira, ten thousand naira, twenty or fifty they give to them. Change there and a dollar. Two thousand ten dollar. It's not up to twenty dollar. It's not up to fifty dollar. And an idiot, a grown up man at this level, at this perilous time, with all these dangers, look at forty seven bikes that are moving to you can't figure this out. Huh. Ma, oh, ma, the, the same thing you are talking about. Our people, they are, our stupidity, their stupidity is too much. Is it, did it not happen on June 12th? When they paid, they didn't see the interview in Yoruba. When people are paying 1,000, 2,000 to come and protest against, uh, against their own, own person. The people were paid now. We have a flavor for everywhere. And they, they, they And uh, one thing is sure. When it, uh, ma, is it, go to that much arena. Most of them that are kids are this idiot. And Onion has placed their card. They don't know when Onion is placing their card. Onion said, the, the ginger is from Mali. I want to you quote the language. Ndike Mali, this deadly ones, they all are dealing with the cow. My God, then go kill all those guys, wait, see. All of them will die. Because as long as you rise up against your, against your state, that land will not keep you. you are, let them collect money, but all of them will go down. One thing is very sure. When Fulanis are killing, the ginger weeds are killing, this is their terrorist army are killing. They don't ask if you belong to Hope or the might not know. Let's take it there. I will deal with you, Mazi. But I bag our hope I can't hear them there. All let them continue. Sabotage are in many ways, and all of them will go down. Thank you, my brother from WhatsApp Poland. I remain okay for it. Thank you. Thank you very much, my dear brother, and keep on the good work you're doing. Yeah. Keep it off. Yeah. We must continue. We are not going to relent. We're not going to surrender. Everybody must press it on but the level of the stupidity in our people is something i can't uh, you know i cannot uh, uh, tolerate uh, in fact may god help may god help us Let's take this call. Call out your live on uh, your name and where you are calling from. I presume um, yeah, my brother from Gabon. Good morning. Yeah, good morning, Mazi. Welcome, brother. Uh, yeah, 
Um, as a, um, I'm hearing what you're saying this morning concerning what is going on in Biafra and around the world. Uh, first of all, my name is Paul, calling from Labor. Uh, Hello, brother. Um, hello, Mazi, are you hearing me? Okay, continue. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what I'm trying to say concerns what our brother has just said now. When I see that video, when people are, are, are jubilating some fools, and they, those who don't know that the, the, the six feet is, a, is, a, is, a, is a, around the corner watching them, saying that they are uh, uh, solidarity with the uh, uh, I want um, I want to tell them that uh, um, those people, this man is killing in the states. I want to let, let you know that when when he, he, the man is bringing army to kill our boys, the, the, those people they are killing doesn't he, he, he doesn't write probing them on, on on them or writing I don't know what they are writing on them. If you are huge, they will kill you. You collect five thousand naira and come and say that the is doing very well. After they, after they left that premises, they maybe they 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 they, they let make sure you get yourself is the police or army. They will shut you down and kill you. So that will show you that our people doesn't some of our people doesn't reason, you know. And there's no problem. Not everybody will see this Biafra coming because there is people who will, who will go foolishly before this Biafra will come. Okay. So our people should rise up. No going back. No going back because Biafra is there already. It is, the spirit of Biafra is going, is running around. As I, I'm always saying, the view is dead. The view is, is dead. They don't see what is it. They don't look what is going on. The view is inside the mortuary. Nobody can resurrect a dead man only to bury him. And, and the, the view will bury themselves. So, now, as this man, I don't want to say. All I have to say is kudos to Ali Damazin and the Kalu. The job he's doing is the running around all over the world. And the, all our people around the world, quote, our blessed people, bless all the local officers, bless the country who are supporting the Biafra nation to come. Thank you, Mazi. Remain blessed. Thank you very much, my dear brother, and keep it up. We must continue and we are not going to relent. This is Radio Biafra Officer Service 2 coming to you from the platform of Radio Biafra London, under the leadership of one and only Union Dumaze Namdekano, Ahmadike, one of Biafra land. Maze Namdekano is the only incorruptible leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, is the director of Radio Biafra and her television, and he is the commander of the armies of Biafra. Brothers, we must continue to do what we are doing. Nobody should be afraid of anything. We have been saying it. Get prepared. Don't allow Janjaweed to kill you. Kill Janjaweed. The soldiers you see there are killing you. You can you understand it. So why are you uh, 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 pitying them or whatever? Destroy them. If that day is your last day, that is it. Everybody has the last day here on earth. Die with them there. Die with them. That will put fear for them for not coming the second time for your brother. But because they pick you, you die like that, they will come again and pick the other one. They won't be afraid, you know. If it is before, they will be coming our place anyhow. But because since the establishment of ESN, and God has sent unknown gunmen for us, and they are doing work, they are afraid now. They don't go anyhow. They just move somehow. If you and I will also become that soldier, you know, in our various homes, in our villages, in our homes, maybe a particular house, they want to go and abduct people, reaching there, all of them die there. Fear will enter them. They will not come again like that, you know. Because they have come with their highest strategy. The strategy there is just this genocide, this method of genocide, genocidal killings. That is what they know. They did this 67 to 70, and they are repeating it. That is their last card. They don't have any other thing. So you and I need to rise up, rise up, button up, and follow them. And must not listen to a full leaf. You must not listen to a full leaf. One thing you must know is that before in the zoological republic before any of our people have been promoted before they have been promoted they will initiate them into their into this their sokoto uh, caliphate cult they will never say anything for your own favor that is why as they are killing you you will not see anybody talking all of them are in abuja
people have you killed? How many people have died in your own uh, constituency? It's not less we are telling you the truth and the only way to fight this thing. You must fight evil before evil will go. These people are evil. They are evil. In the north, governor made budget for bandits. They are begging Boko Haram to repent and this swap and whatever and come back to them. But to you, they are killing you. Even a man who cannot go back to his village, the so-called security chiefs and whatever, they can't go to their village and stay for one day. None of them. But they are coming in your village to bring peace for you, courtesy of your governors. You see what is going on. We need to understand. You don't need a prophet to, to interpret the handwritings of, on the wall. You know who's supposed to know who is who. This man is my enemy. This man is not speaking for me. History will tell you the truth if you read history very well. They start killing you since 1945. What is your sin? Even during the slave trade, they contributed in selling you. Till today, they are still killing you. And somebody called himself as Ndibo because they have given him some contract on behalf of the Ibos. And he's enjoying uh, uh, getting money from those contracts, which they will come and kill him one day. You know, because they are just like a Christmas chicken. You keep in your house, feeding it, waiting for the date for Christmas. Then you kill that chicken. That is how they are. Now they are telling you that nothing, that they are not in support, this, that. Don't listen to them because that day, there and you will die. Some of them may escape because they are rich. They can fly off, but you don't have any other option than to travel from that north within this road that has been blocked now by the, uh, by the bandits. You will die on the road. Wake up now and do the needful thing. The war is there already. When your so-called police and army will see an innocent man and they take him and shoot him, what again do you want? Innocent people, even most of the people they are killing are not even members of IPOB. They might not even support IPOB at all, but they are killing them. It is the time you need to understand what is going on and do what we ask you to do. And continue to tune in on Radio Biafra. Don't, there are people full of hatred and foolishness. They'll be telling you all manner of things. You shouldn't listen to those people. When they are just talking rubbish. But you that have the, the the blood is flowing in in your in your vein, you understand it is in your gene. Do what we are doing, and sooner or later, you will see it, and Biafra will come. And you see, people start living a good life again. It's possible. We are in the world, you know. We are in the world. So take it, my dear people, and uh, let's continue to do what we are asked to do, and Biafra will come. I'll be right back. for his grace and uh, 
We want to greet you all of you and uh, our leader, Imam Dekalo, and the, the girls, YG Professor, and uh, Your line is reconnecting. I think your network. Network, 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 network. Your network is not clear. Hello? All right, continue. Hello, can you hear me, sir? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Kachuko Kadama. 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 Kachuko Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, my dear brother. Keep it up. Thank you very much. He's all right, sir. Thank you. He's all right, sir. Yo, this is the song written from me to you, all you Biafran soldiers out there on the roads. One for all, all for one, I'm the kind of IPOB, my tongue. We spread coming big home, I swamp people with love. We are Biafrans, the shine bright, the flourish in the land. Like the truth of heaven, now you're planted in the house of God. It's not formidable, they can hurt us, remain unstoppable. They can break us, and they must be proud, sick, the face of God. So strong. We never stop the fight for freedom rights. Every tribe to our united nations. But we are for the world to see us. We unite to fight for freedom rights. Right girls on people. Let us fight for one time. We put it on us. The born and brought you crap. Then it's good to do the good night. Call on the line. Can you hear me? <laughs> Caller, can you hear me? Should be Ghana yes, National Piaro. Can you hear me? Yes, I'm here. You do my Shalom. Yeah, I can hear you now. Hello? Okay. Uh, uh, your honey, be Raise your voice a bit on, from your phone. Okay. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, hey, Biafra. Uh, this one is... I want to comment on one of the issues that you raised about or Halez and Hibo in uh, Hausa or Northern Nigeria. One thing about them is that they are not representing anybody. They are like the politicians, you know. They are only representing their stomach. They don't. They don't represent even. Let 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 them kill one person in the north today. You see, if if those uh, the Ohalese in the uh, in the north, whether they will speak, they will not even make a an utterance. So what they are is uh, the contract they have given them and the money they have given to them for them to eat it and. Uh, you know, come out and be saying rubbish. If they care, do we say that they should care about IPOB? From 2014 or, or 2015, they started killing of us. That are we do we say we should, we are whether they care or not. That one thing is certain is that only leader we have in Biafra as a whole is Martin Nandekano. He is the one we are looking up to, not the politicians, nor AZ. Because even if they used to say that he was done half AZ. We don't have a king. God is our king. And he has been watching over us since 1914 to today. And not the Ohale Dibo and whatever they call themselves. What I'm telling our people as you're saying is that they should not listen to those men. Even in the north, there is it where they started killing them. They kill them and they will not say anything. When they kill them, then they will not say anything. Even our politicians, they will not say anything. Even the ones in the north, they are so our people should rise up, our people should rise up and support our leader. They should support our, our ESN, you know, in the good work they are doing. But they should stop listening to the, the charlatans, those in the north, 
what they are, what they are carrying is only their stomach, them sending their children abroad to come and study and, and leave others. They don't care if they go or not, you know. What they are, know is they have big generator that will be giving them electricity because I know that that place they are, and now there is no electricity. So our people should stand up and support our little mountain and the canoe and support Biafra. You know, I used to call like the protest they say they, they had in, uh, in Imo State. You know, Ndebema, our people, they say that they paid them easy 500 to come and protest in, uh, in favor of uh, Hopu Zodema. But what I'm asking our people in Ebema, our youth in Ebema, after you protest for Hopu Zodema, have you given you employment? After you protest for Hopu Zodema, have you given you electricity? Because even in Ebema, where exactly, I come Exactly, my dear Ebema, brother, these are the areas we need to continue to pass the message. These are the areas. Now they are telling they gave them 500. Why he did not use that 500 since or do something for you? These are the things our youth need to understand. Because by the time they understand it, this job will be more easier for us. To tell you, that somebody who is giving you money to come and support him, that means there is no justice in that person. Because if the person is honest and you are honest, wherever you see honesty, that's where you go. But our people don't know that. And you know, everybody knows that this man is evil. This ad Fulani administrator in Imo State is an evil man. Since he came in, look at what is happening. The entire state has been oh. devastated. And he's giving you money to come and show to the world that you are supporting him and you accept. Whereby the dead bodies of your own brothers and sisters are still in money. Some are missing. And the Al-Shabaab soldiers oh. are still killing people there. And they are giving you money and you are accepting. How much, how many uh, bucket of gare would that thing buy for you? And you sold your, con your, your entire life completely. Please, we need to speak up to educate to them. We know that some of them don't have light. They don't have internet to listen. But anyhow, we can communicate with them. Uh, let's tell them, you endure the hunger for a moment. Light is coming okay. after that. Right on, brothers. Yes. Uh, Mas, what, I'm saying, uh, what I'm saying is that, you know, any governor that enters in the state would like to use or hard even my paper. Uh, uh, this man, Rota Sokrocha, did it. Immediately he entered, he saw how you remember my youth that he used. But one thing they should ask themselves, after using them, how is their life? Have their life improved? Have they gotten anything from them? They will still go back. Maybe if they give them 2,000, highest, highest money they can give to each youth in any of these protests is 2,000. Then how many days will you eat the 2,000? So uh, let me speak in my dialect. In the Bima, because if you are not I always be protest I live state for hope who's them I will support you hope who's them Johnny Ahone, if all the day protest manical problem, hope who's them about Rane, hope who's them will be out in the governing state. Hope who's them about a fort to the state, and you will govern on the full and you will govern on here because in the full and you will be out in the or rather, we must take the effort when you are position of governor, which law will be shaped for governor. So, on your brand, you will be born in Bema, Ile Lana, or Boga Katri, Boke, or we will use the Biko, Mopus of Dema, or any politician, you must take the more labor money, Eko, Ibia, Ija, the protest, the only who puts of Dema, Ejela. My country, you will find out if my country, Ejela, just a only if you like. Bono, <laughs> So even now, one day you tell me, and then and then and then, even they were born with Biko John Yani in Nande Kano. Oh, he was also put out of the Odo, Nande Kano, be a boy, the Nani file at your own half in the politician circle. Where you are, okay, I'm not a speaker, la, you must say, House of Assembly. They came from an endeavor. Only for that, but actually, I'm an endeavor. I'm not proper. Many politicians in the world, Kai from Kai from village, you know, that I should not. Oh, you go to you for me, no. So when they come, when they come, they will tell them. When they use the law, when they come, when they push protests, when they many who push them, mama, many politicians are coming because they really vote if they. When they push, they join the IPO, they get any Biafra. 
So, Mazinga Chineke, I want to appreciate you for your good work. I just want to speak to them because any governor that comes to you will say, We like to use or hide you my youth. Any governor that comes to you will say, I don't know why. I don't know why. The, 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 the funny thing is that they went for the protest, but I, ha I heard that the boss man they hired, they didn't pay the man and they didn't want to cause fight. You understand? So, Mazi, may I bless you and I want to also appreciate our leader, Mazi Nandekano, for the good work he's doing. I want to appreciate our our ESN or no government make a car protect all of you wherever you are. And also our national coordinator here in Ghana, Mas Gilos I want to appreciate him, he's doing well. And I pray may Elohim protect him, may Elohim spread to give you more wisdom to carry out this movement until we reach our we reach our Biafra land. Thank you, Mazi, for picking my comment. You say, you say. Thank you very much, my dear brother. Thank you very much. And may the most high strengthen each and every one of us thank you very much our people need to understand what is going on all this way politicians are using you you're supposed to have sense by now stop it stop it five on as if they are giving you something that will sustain you for life that one would have been somehow considerable 501 they will call you tomorrow come and do the man is evil they are evil none of these politicians will be spared all of them will go down. It has started, it will not. So stop giving them support. Let the world, because the more you come out and protest and they do their Facebook live, international communities are seeing all those things, thinking that it is true, not knowing that you have been paid, not knowing that you don't know what you are doing. People who will come and help you will think, oh, they are one. Stop all those rubbish and allow the natural justice to take place. These people need to go down. They are evil. They are killing people in Imo State day and night. None of the House of Assembly member represent, none of them are talking. Everybody just, yeah, and they are killing people. And they call you to come and support that it is lie. No, sir, brother, enough for all these things. But all of you that are organizing those things, those you that are organizing, we are telling you there is no difference between you and those working with BBC. Bo. There is no difference between you and the so-called politician. And there is no difference between you and the Fulani Janjaweed, the Al-Shabaab, the soldiers. Because at the time, all of you will pay. Because you know what you are doing. You are bringing our people to come and give solidarity to an evil man. We are telling you because your own day is coming. Because they will bring the money. When they give you the money, you will share it, take your own portion. By the time you take your own portion, then uh, 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 you now try to share maybe five, five naira or ten, ten naira to the so-called uh, ones that don't know their left and right and use it to organize what you want. You are the head. We will fo fo follow you. You will pay for it because this time there's no mercy. There's no mercy. We must continue. Thank you very much, my dear brother. You don't have a one time freedom for spilling the blood for finesse and Biafra. We don't messy and we can't forgive. When the time comes off for payback, and we can't forget all you best us. Come on, come on, come on. We are France soldiers, where you are now? Where you are? Where you are? Where you are now? It can happen. Where you are now? Where you are? Where you are? Where you are now? We are France soldiers, where you are now? Where you are? Where you are? Where you all now? They can help us. Yo, we spread the head and become a swamp. People want love. We are Pierre France. Because in 1914, Nigeria was created for the interests of the British government by the head of federal government. I did be afraid in Nigeria, keep us stealing our resources that was wrong. With this government that was wrong and evil. Only God can create a nation, that's why we've come to be a nation as we're supposed to be. We are gathering our troops from across the world to unite our nations, be afraid. Coming like invisible, but visible from what to see as we unite to fight for freedom, right? Because, um, people, uh, let us fight for one time. We